Hey guys, we're back with more of the Battle Axe run. We're gonna make our way through Iron Keep. We're halfway through it, as you can see. We gotta get to Old Iron King. Still gotta do Freya, and we still gotta do the Rotten. Sander's done, though. Soon, Old Iron King will be too. Nice. Shouldn't take too long with these, though. We should be able to get through this easily enough. The moveset for axes is just so, so good. Axes, hammers, essentially the same moveset. Maybe there's, like, slight differences, but... The L1 is the same. You know, the R1 actually might be different. I don't know. L1's the same, though. And that's what I am using here. Uh-oh, don't fall. I think the R1's the same, too, actually. I think I'll just run through here. Honestly, I don't think... I'm not gonna get the bonfire. I think we'll be fine without it. You know what? Screw that guy. We're just gonna go kill this dude. Okay, this might be a problem. Yeah, that's not great. Alright, just die. Thank you. You. Don't kill me. Okay, we're fine. Where'd he go? Huh. Interesting. Does he not know how to turn? No, no, he does. He just didn't want to. For whatever reason. Freedom! Now we just need to not get yeeted into the abyss here. Or into the lava. And we'll be set. So how did I get 20,000 souls? Did I just get those? <laughs> I actually have no idea. Laser? No laser. That works. One more hit. Easy. I guess we'll do the rotten next. Then we'll do Freya after that. Let's go back, touch the primal bonfire, and return. Hmm, should maybe get, think about getting bright bugs. Two more ints, gonna need it. We'll do endurance to 20, and I'll probably keep it there for a bit. I'm not gonna worry about bright bugs. I never worry about bright bugs. Never once. I say I should, but I don't. Also, I needed to keep like 13 and a half K, so that kind of sucks. We'll use this. Hmm. Hang on. How much are they? Like 24K or 18K? Uh, I do want one. But like there's plenty to buy. I mean, I still have the all of them in um, New Game Plus too. I do that. I'll worry about the effigies later. We get the ring, we'll go down to the rotten cat ring, that is. Bye. Yes. I don't remember when, at what point these are, there's like infinitely many alluring skulls. Actually, I'm going to buy some of these. Oh. Since I don't have homeward. Do that. And descend. Can I survive this? I'm going to find out. Yes, I don't know if I can survive this one, though. I could have. Rather be safe than sorry, though. 
Do I even want Sublime Bone Dust? Like, I have two Estes. It's probably not worth it. Probably no Sublime Bone Dust. I don't think I'm gonna get it. Oof. Nope, not, nope, 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 not Homer Bone. Absolutely not. Like, there are times where I like to use, uh... Oh, jeez. There are times where I like to use Estus. Because they give you, like, faster heals than Life Gems. But, like, not being able to move while you use them. Life Gems are just, I think, the better option most of the time. And if I don't get any Sublime Bonus, they're probably better, like, all the time. Or at least more than they would be if I had some. Poisoned. Am I gonna miss the- oh my god, that was way too close. Please go in. I frame it. Nice. Saved. And not believe I didn't get hit there. Or I- it's not that I didn't get hit. I guess, but also, like, the fact that I didn't die to fall to my death. Kind of amazing. No, please stop. I actually am a little worried I will- is this a big drop? Oh, whatever. We're going in. It's not. I just never had to think about it, because I never, like, have no health, or half health there. Black Gulch! Looks more like Green Gulch to me. I mean, it's black, it's not that it's not. It's just the green is more, uh, apparent, I feel. Oh, not to the black, I don't know. It's- it, the green is, like, pops out more. Black doesn't really pop out. Green Gulch doesn't really sound as good, I guess. Although, it has alliteration going on, so maybe... Maybe it is better. Here we get iframes in the fog gate. Lame. Rodden, hang on. Alright, let's go. You and me. Damn, 20 endurance and I just still constantly out of stamina. Grab this. Nice. I didn't know if that last hit would actually get him or not. Alright, one more boss here. Rest. Or return, whatever. It's not really resting. Another level up. 230 Vigor. I kind of want to keep going Endurance, but honestly, I should probably get some more ends because we're going to be enchanted in not too long. Alright, let's go to Freya, or towards Freya. We gotta do, what, Mitha? No, not Mitha, Najka. Always get those two names confused still. I've done, like, so many runs of this game. Najka, the other one, and then Freya. Magus. Right, Magus and the Congregation. Ten dudes in a room together, bam. That's your boss. It's like, imagine if, uh, you come into this room, there's a foggy right here. And you gotta fight all the guys in here. That's what it feels like. Kind of. Got neon green hair, dark green eyebrows, cyan beard. That is a look. Go! I'll grab this. So we'll get the Chlorothy Ring, gotta grab that, and then there's a chunk above the bonfire in the Shaded Ruins. Ow, dude, come on. Why are you throwing... Uh, I assume it's a rock. Could be poop, I don't know. I think if it was poop, though, I'd get poisoned. How many chunks do I have? I think zero, actually, because I think... Am I at 
two plus sevens? Yeah. So I have zero chunks. I need another ten. Yikes. We're probably not gonna get plus tens until Chloan. I don't know where to get enough chunks for two weapons without buying a bunch from her or farming. I even farming, I don't know where you would farm. I have no idea. I'm sure you can farm something, but I don't know what. All right, I have no clue where I'm going, so I'm just kind of winging it until I find something that looks familiar. Hey, look, found the right thing. Run! Anyone behind me? I don't see one. Good, though. We out. Can you not, uh, can you, maybe you can jump here, hang on. Well, that didn't work. I'm just curious. Jump along the... Yeah, look at that. Again. It's probably no faster than walking around the thing here, though. <laughs> oh, no travel. We're good. Grab that chest up there for the chunk. And there's three more in Seldora that I can think of. There might, there's probably another one somewhere, or some ones, maybe. But we should be able to get plus eight before drink Leic on both of these things. Okay, you do not go near the chest. You go near the chest and I will be sad because I don't want to break the chest. Missing a chunk is one thing. If you miss that dragon bone because you break that chest, that would suck. Dragon bone is not easy to come by outside of DLC 2. All right, Nashka. Scorpioness Nashka. Definitely a weird encounter though, right? Like, you just see like a... a naked woman... sitting in the sand. Damn it, stupid rock. Thank you. Just die. Thank you. I don't know where we'll end up in like another 40 minutes. Probably past Drangleic. Definitely past Drangleic. Maybe... Hmm. Not Giant Lord. Probably not Giant Lord. I'm hoping through at least like a mana. Then we gotta remember to enchant this thing. For things. Full taxes. I feel like I've been doing a lot less power stancing lately. In this game and Elden Ring. I think when I first started doing these runs, I was playing on power stancing literally everything. But, uh, I don't know. I kind of changed my tune and I'm like, you know what? I can do like cosplay runs or something just to, to be different, you know, because like if you power stance every run, I feel like it would get old. That's just me, though. Keep going here. I'll probably go level after. Maybe I'll just level after Freya. Maybe we just run straight through Freya here. We can upgrade. We can level up. Hopefully it won't die. Ooh. Nice, all four of them. I feel like that's pretty rare. Wow, really? Not dead, huh? Everyone's favorite boss. Rallic Magus! Coming right up. Please die in one hit. Nice. Now you? Yeah. Every time, like, wait, I think whenever you kill one of these guys. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. It's fine. Well, fight's over.
Good fight. I don't remember, you don't get a boss off of this guy, do you? You didn't die from that? You get a slab. I don't know what else you get. I don't think you get a boss soul. Oh, you just get a slab. Okay. Well, that answers that. I have a torch. I have five flame butterflies. I think I'm going to use a torch just to get to Frey, but I'm not going to do the fight with the torch. You have what? Twinkling Titanite and a dragon bone? Yeah, whatever. It's fine. I'm not too worried about that. It's either a chunk of it, it's a dragon bone and something. Can't remember what the second thing is, though. What do you have? Not helpful. Only the most pleasant sounds here. Oh, come on, man. Not good. Just let me in. Hmm. Do you get iframes when you use a flame butterfly? Because I did not take damage there. That's interesting. Get out of here. Uh oh, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm not getting out of here. Ugh, sandwiched. Well, on the plus side, those dudes don't get aggroed if you don't go in the spikes. Let's see what this guy's got. Chunk? Oh, it is a chunk. Nice. Okay. That's good. I need... Hmm. Yeah, I could get one weapon to plus ten. I'd rather just have two plus eights, though. Although I could do... No, I can only do plus eight for both, or one to plus nine. Well, ten, because I have a slab. Two slabs. All right, you come out. Come on. I do not like you. How did you land a hit after you died? Just DS2 things. All right, torch can go away once we get in here. All right, spiders coming. Line up. Hmm. I don't see what hit me there. I don't know if it was a little, I think it was a little dude. Little, little dude. Goodbye, little dude. Nice to be able to actually do two attacks. Okay, maybe maybe roll next time. Uh oh. When in doubt, life gem out. Oh, goodbye to your head. How can, how can Freya do anything if the head's just, like, not working? I know there's two heads, but, like... Do you think you would shut down one side or something? I wonder if you can actually take out both heads. I don't know. I feel like probably not. Oh, I didn't even see the spider. Thank you, Great Soul Embrace text. Honestly, I don't even know why I kill this guy. I don't really need to. I guess it just prevents him from being over here when all these spawned in. Hello, Scholar of the First Sin, Aldia. How are you? Hang on. Ah, whatever. So amazing voice acting right there. Some of the best I've heard. Ever. Okay, back to Majula. 
Definitely gonna buy rate bugs, actually. I think they're, what, 24k? 36k? Damn it. Buy them all. And we're good on life gems. Buy these. I guess we will not level. Instead, we will go to the Shaded Woods. Right here. Don't really have any other rings, do I? I have this one, but that's not going to do me anything. Oh, I forgot to upgrade. We can do that maybe after uh, we get the Drink Lake. I remember. Open up. Hey, did I get backstabbed? I did. That did not do much damage, though. I was expecting, like, three times that. Effigy. Another one for the collection. I don't think I've used one yet. Twelve. Nice. It's always nice to have just a bunch, you know? Never know if you're going to need them. I don't think we're going to need a ton on this run, but... I don't know if things hit hard in the DLC. You never know. Trying to get through the frigid outskirts can be pretty rough. Iron Keep. A lot of rough stuff to come. This is the easy part of the run. Literally everything before a new game. Plus. <laughs> it's easy. At least with this thing, this thing is uh, pretty solid. The Battle Axe. Enchanted, I imagine, will be probably worse. Just because I don't have, like, no strength. They have 23, which isn't terrible. Right, I forgot about these dudes. Like, the extra guys, I mean. Did I really just aggro this guy? Oh, great. Whoa! When you die, you were almost dead, right? Yeah, perfect. Where's the crossbowman? How did that one hit? It? What a backstep. As a legend. I'm definitely tempted to effigy here. I'll probably wait until I'm at the bonfire, though. I get the bonfire. I can never rest here in time. This guy always catches up. Oh, not today. Most of the time he catches up. Probably like 85 to 90% of the time he will be uh, on top of me as I'm getting the bonfire. I don't remember what is in the chest. It's, I think the, it's the door on the same side all the way at the end of the room. I think it's the racing knuckle ring. One of them. Plus one, maybe. I think that one's in there, because I can't think what else that would be. Speaking of uh, durability, how is the durability on this? I haven't looked. Hasn't really been an issue. 60? Okay. It's pretty average. Oh yeah, I was gonna... yeah, whatever. I was gonna upgrade, but I forgot. It's fine. Dragon Rider Duo. Ah, in my head. Launched in my head and now it's gone. Just like that. When does this guy come down? Now, apparently. I was gonna say it's like 50% of this guy's health, I think. Okay, one down. Just this guy who's got like less than half of the other guy's health. Who needs to upgrade? We got two plus sevens. I'll go upgrade. You can go here actually, because then I can I can just go to Landigrass, it's fine. And level. That's mainly the reason for going here. Reinforce one and one. So I need another four chucks. However, There's a shard. Take my shard. Int. 
Lin Lady P, probably. Not a bad idea. The flame butterflies can go away. Don't need those anymore. And back to Drink Lake. I'm super jaded at this uh, next part. It's not bad in New Game, it's just New Game Plus. It kind of sucks. With the mannequins and trying to get them to come in this room and not kill you. I mean, they can still stun lock you pretty badly. But honestly, I could probably just take one out here and then fight the other one in here. Might not be able to do that in New Game Plus. Come on. Anything we need this way? I mean, there's an Estus shard, but like, nah. When do I ever need those? You can't even homeward away here, because I'm pretty sure the uh, elevator would reset from the top. So you have to actually wait for it to come down. Doesn't reset if you rest, though, which is interesting. Up we go. Man, can you imagine doing only one playthrough per run? Pfft. It'd be almost done. Well, not really. I have so many optional bosses I haven't killed. I guess the thing with that, too, is like, it'd be so easy to do so many bosses. Like, I could go back and do all the easy stuff after like a plus 10. I'm at like, you know, a much higher level. It'd be so nice. Why do I do it this way? Because I hate myself. <laughs> I think I secretly do. I do like the challenge of New Game Plus, though. In the uh, DS1, DS2, Demon Souls. I think things are definitely harder in Bloodborne. More so, like, in the early game, though. I feel like the later game isn't too bad. Like, not compared to New Game, anyway. Like, New Game Plus is... It's, it's more difficult, but it doesn't feel, like, insanely difficult like the early game does. I just bring up the stat about Amelia getting, like, four times her HP in New Game Plus. Which is more than... Is it more than Orphan has in New Game? I'm not sure about that, but it might be. Like, she goes from, like, 5k to 20,000 HP, and then she also heals for... I think it's 15% of her HP every time she heals, so... She gets more, almost as much health back in New Game Plus as she has in New Game. It's quite crazy. And it really sucks when your damage is bad. Shield, shield. It's fine. He's pretty much dead. Imagine being this guy, finally getting out of the mirror, and then immediately dying. His looking glass knight couldn't stay alive. It's like when you get summoned into a co-op game, and the host dies immediately, and then you're just like, oh wait, I have to sit through another loading screen again. Great. I mean, that's pretty much what happened, right? Looking glass knight summoned a dude, died immediately, dude gets sent back home. What a scrub. Okay, maybe we'll get through Undead Crypt. That'd be cool. And we just have Dragon Shrine. And I guess Guardian Dragon. Somehow I always forget about Guardian Dragon. Uh, I'm gonna go level up, I think. Before we go through here. Forgot I had a shard. Even though I just picked it up. A little more Int, ADP, Faith. Gotta get Faith to 18, gotta get Attunement to 10. Life Gems, we're good. Alright, back here. I'm on it. Such beautiful singing. Is there one in here? I haven't been in this building in forever. Oh, hello. Why did I... Why... What's wrong with me? Why would I do this to myself? Oh my god. I, I am certainly dead. I had to check, didn't I? All right, I am going to use one of those effigies now. Oh, yeah, I forgot to hand in the shard. Whoops. It's all right. 
I think about all the runs I've done in this game, and it's like super nice that the ladle is done, because I think that's probably the hardest run there will be. I've done a great bow run. Great bow runs are also kind of tricky, because a lot of exists. But like, there really isn't much harder than that. I, I think that's pretty much it. Pyromancy I've done. I haven't done a miracle run yet. Oddly. Kind of surprised. Done like 30. I think this is the 38th weapon. And not one miracle run. Hey. Be nice. Give me iframes. Respect the iframes. Why are you here? Go away. Honestly, I think in like most of the games, except for maybe Demon Souls, I've done probably the hardest weapons. Or like some of the hardest weapons. And you can thank Twitch requests for that. Because the odds of like rolling bad weapons are not great. If there's like, you know, let's say 10 bad weapons out of 100 something or 200. If the odds are not great, then you're going to do all of them. Okay, well this is not good. This is indeed bad. Oh, I actually got the life gem off, though. I didn't realize that. I'm healing. I think there will be some interesting bad weapons, though. Like, bad, yes, but at least, like, a good challenge. War cook. It's gonna be kind of ladle esque. I think it has bleed though, which is nice. As long as it doesn't break as often as the ladle does, then it'll be fine. Okay, you too, come on. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna walk right by you, I guess. Let me in. Thank you. Okay. They, they don't respect the iframes. They literally just hit me as soon as they can. I hate it. Who's this summon? Who are you? Felicia the Brave. Uh-oh. Armor is broken, that's fine. It doesn't really do anything anyway. How about the rings? Rings are looking all right. Peculiar Kindler. Wait, what is this attack? He can he can swat more than one time there? I I just, okay. <laughs> Flabbergasted. Had no idea. I'm so pale. I th I'm pretty sure my dude is supposed to be green. Why am I so pale? Maybe just the lighting. Looks very bright. Damn. Trying to get one more R1 in there. Rest in peace. Hello, Mr. Cyan Knights. Or Madam Cyan Knights, I guess I don't really know. Either way, I'm coming through. Don't do it, don't do it. See ya. Should've done a little wave. Don't need this bonfire, I don't want Aldi to spawn. Don't wanna to have to listen to him talk. Maybe I can just spawn him and leave him on, uh, read. Or red. That's a problem with having one word have two different pronunciations. Are you left on read or are you left on red? I assume it's red. 
but maybe it's Reed. You know, I never hear anyone say it. I just see it text, or not text it out, but like typed out. 40k. Yeah, we can do Vail Stout. And then we'll do a level up after that. And before I get pancaked by the shield door guys. Or door shield. Shield door and door shield. Probably door shield. Uh oh. Yeah, that's fine. Lady of Pyromancers are cowards. They're not really. They're actually insanely strong. And I hate fighting them. I love fighting Velstat. Such a satisfying fight. I think it's just got a great moveset. There's generally like no crazy hitboxes. Just a good, clean fight. A lot of dinging though. Nice whiff. Nice two. Nice two. He has now got the power of damage resistance. And I am not a fan. Oh, staggered him. My god. There we go. Nice and easy. Soul of Velstat. Cool. Homeward. Let's get out of here. Let's go level up and we can upgrade too. We can buy the chunks. Do that first. Give me what do I need? Four or three? I can't remember. Three. No. What about three? I don't actually know. I can't remember what these are out of. These at Okay. I need two more then. Actually. Counting is hard. Oh yeah, we can uh, infuse, so we'll go to McDuff. Two, 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 please give me two. Thank you. And then we need the magic stone. I think the faint stone is magic. This is... See, why does it say in imbues weapon with magic? It's not true. It makes it enchanted. Right? Am I crazy? Cannot be used on shields. Yeah, no, this is the right thing. I saw the shields. I didn't read cannot be used on... I just saw shields, and I'm like, is there a shield infusion I am unaware of? All right, Macduff. Here. Like, this doesn't imbue anything with magic. It's physical damage. Nope, oh, stop. Infuse. Yes. Enchanted. Enchanted. Oh, D? Oof. That's rough. Okay, C. C at worst. I don't. I doubt it went up to B, but. Um. Oops. Nope, not, not what I want. Yeah, it's C. Wonder how much damage we just lost. We'll go level up. Oh, I have another. Uh, is this the one I forgot to give her? Can't remember. No idea. Let's see. More int. Yikes. I guarantee once we go above 30, it'll add more damage. That did not add much, though. I, I went up four levels of int to get one. Attack rating. That's disheartening. Nothing else to do. I guess we're going to go back to here. So I think I'll call this one here. Next time we will pick up with all the escape. We'll get through new game and we'll start up new game plus. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching.